Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. You might remember a few months ago when ThinkGeek sent me a USB microscope to review. Uh, that particular unit was designed with kids in mind, and it was nice. Resolution wasn't all that high, neither was the frame rate, and the software was relatively janky. I couldn't even get it to work with the Mac. Well, uh, when they gave me the opportunity to take a look at the Dino Light digital microscope, uh, this is a 1.3 megapixel USB microscope. I said, yeah, I'm all for it. I, I love USB gadgets and I love digital microscopes. Uh, the ProScope that I had purchased a few years ago uh, kind of broke and it wasn't worth replacing. And to tell you the truth, this microscope is, well, 1.3 megapixels times better than that other one that I had and the software actually does work. It has Windows software, it alleges to have Windows Vista ca capability or compatibility, and it will also work with the Mac, with the Mac driver. That being said, the Mac software leaves a lot to be desired. It's definitely not perfect. It does work, however, some of the features are only enabled in software mode, and the Mac software got virtually no attention by the development team, which is kind of par for the course, but shame on you. No matter, uh, I've got VMware Fusion running here, so I've got the USB microscope connected to that right now. The Windows software is okay, it's not amazing, it does work, it records video, still photos, you can toggle things on and off, mostly in software, because this is it, this is the hardware. Uh, the stand is, is right here, it's got this neck that can bend and pivot and stay stationary if you'd like it to. The USB microscope, uh, is, is currently strapped on like by Velcro straps, but this is the size of it here. It's not even the, the size of like a, well, I guess a bulky cigar, a half a cigar really. It's like the length of a finger, and I guess it's a circumference of about a quarter. So it's not that big at all, very lightweight. You can see uh, the LED lights inside can be toggled on and off. The zoom mechanism is actually a dial on the microscope, and I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, Chris, shut up already. Show us some cool stuff, all right. So we've got the software running, in theory. Oh, I've got a, my screensaver kicked in. There we go. <laughs> Forgot about that. All right, here we go. Now here we, we're going to start the tour, uh, starting with my, the palm of my hand. As I zoom in, oh, there we go. There, oh, that's not very interesting. Let's go to the back of my hand. How's that? Oh, yeah, look at that. You see that? Look, it's dirt. Oh, yeah, it's microscopic dirt. Yeah, oh, look at those wrinkles. You, I look like a, a big pink elephant here. But I tell you, the resolution is quite sharp. I don't know if you're able to tell. So I'm going to put it up to my uh, chin here and show you the hairs on my chinny chin chin. Oh, that one hasn't even surfaced. Uh, let, let's try oh, wait, 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 almost had one. That one hasn't surfaced either. Let's try up here on my lip. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yuck. Can you believe that's on my face? You. Let's go over here to my cheek. Yeah, my cheek looks a lot like my... Oh, 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 there was a hair. There was a hair. I saw a hair. Oh, good. Ooh. It's kind of hard to get it zoomed in exactly and hold completely still since it's so small. All right, well, that's enough of that. Let's go to my hair up on top of my head. There we go. Got to zoom it out a bit. Yeah, look at that. Uh-huh. Last time you saw a forest like that, it was probably Return of the Jedi with some Ewoks. Look at that. It's the Forest of Endor. Look at that. It's pretty amazing. This is live. This is in real time. 1.3 megapixel image there. Is that a gray hair? Oh, I'm out. Oh, let's take a look at Wicket. Wicket Wicket's going to join us. Wicket, wait. Wait. We're going to take a look at you now. Got to get it just right. Don't move. Don't move. Boy, you're hard to focus, buddy. It's because your hair is going a million... Oh, they're... they're there's the, there's one hair there. That's one hair? Dang. Oh, that's many hairs. You've got microscopic hairs. No wonder you're so soft, buddy. No wonder you're so soft. Thank you for being soft. Okay, that's enough. Be golden! Let's try looking up my nose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's the best one yet. Yeah. Ew. Ew. I know what you're thinking. Oh, no, he didn't. Oh, I did. Look at that. <gasps> Oh, oh, yeah, seriously, that's my nose. That's live, man, that's in real time. All right, let's look at something far less disgusting. Let's look at my table. See if you wondered if this was real wood or not. That should uh, answer your question. It's obviously not real wood. Uh, let's take a look at the iPhone. Let's turn it on. 
Oh, look at that. Let's zoom out, zoom in. Oh, there we go. RGB, RGB, RGB. Can you see it? All right, well, let's take a look at my fleece. Ooh, nice and fibrous. It's, it's almost as soft as my dog there. That's my fleece. All right, let's try my blue jeans. And I'm guessing they're going to be, oh, yep, yeah, what do you know? Blue. Yep, yep, I knew it. There we go. See, I mean, I'm telling you, man, it's, it's really good resolution. All right, what about my sock here? Ew. Very fibrous once again, and dang, what is that? You know what would freak me out if I was doing something like this and something like ran across it? That would totally freak me out, you know what I'm saying? All right, so I've got a, a little picture here of Wicket and Pixie that I took the other day. Uh, let's try looking and see how that turned out. Oh, interesting. You can actually, I don't know if you can make it out from where you're at. You can actually make out the lines. I mean, obviously a, a series of dots, but uh, you can actually make out a series of crisscrossed uh, lines. If I can get it to focus perfectly, which I can't. It's so difficult. Of course, here's printed material. You have may have uh, looked at something like that before. If I get in really close. Look at that. Looks like Bozo the Clown just threw up all over my monitor. That's this. All right, let's take a look at a dollar. I guess it's a $20 bill. There we go. Let's see if we can get Andrew Jackson's eye here. If I can find it. It's so hard. Like, if you just make the smallest move, it just, like, moves by miles here. It's crazy. All right, let's try looking. Can I get in there? I thought there were, like, words in here somewhere if I can find them. I'm just so close. The problem is the magnification is so strong. I guess it's not too much of a problem. So I can, I can change the magnification just by zooming out just a bit. So I'm able to tell a little bit more there. Sorry for making everybody sick if I am. Interesting stuff, though, when you're able to zoom in. Let's take a look at a Kleenex. Oh, yeah, that's that's white. Look at that. That's, that's, again, fibrous. Okay. Leather. Here's my wallet. This is Coach, Coach Leather up close. Again, disgusting. Let's uh, zoom in. Let's get even closer. See if you go... See, that's like the super uber magnification. And dang. Ugh. Yuck. And the stuff is smooth, but that's what leather looks like up close. Kind of crackly. Uh, I haven't tried this one yet. This is a, just a Purell hand sanitizer. I thought it'd be interesting to try to get the bubbles. If I can get to the magnification right. Uh, maybe a little too close. Let me go out a little bit. Oh, yeah. Nice and disgusting. Look at that. Look at that. It's kind of fun, though. Got to admit. This, I know, is cool. Silk. This is what silk looks like. This is Thai silk. Uh, green. Well, primarily green uh, under a microscope. Look at that. Look at that. Just, just perfect. I mean, you compare that to, you know, my shirt or my pants or my socks. Look at that. Perfect. Like, it just uh, amazing. In fact, I think I can, if I go in really close, I can, I can get a closer shot of it. Give me a second. It's, it takes, it takes a, a fine hand to fine tune that. There we go. Look at that. Isn't that just amazing? Oh, my God. That's what silk looks like, or at least this is what Thai silk, or this Thai silk shirt looks like. It's hard to get it perfectly focused. Uh, one more thing I'm going to try. Ponzi actually got that Thai silk in Thailand when she was there. Is this uh, wristwatch? Ponzi's wristwatch. The metal. Let's see if I can get the. Uh, that's not going to work very well. Just get a metal metal chain here. There we go. You can tell the time, kind of. Not really though. Oh, there we go. Z. Z. I don't know what the Z stands for. I didn't even know she had a Z on here. Who the hell's the Z on here? I didn't even know. Who knew? All right. Anyway, 1.3 megapixel uh, digital microscope connects by USB, Mac, and Windows compatible. You may have to download the latest software from uh, the official website, which, of course, is not ThinkGeek. You can buy it, however, at ThinkGeek.com. And i got to thank them, again, for passing this thing along. I have a feeling it's going to take a permanent place on my desk uh, because it's just... It's just a lot of fun to do. It's just too much fun to do. See, I mean, you want me to do the nose again, don't you? All right, fine. Fine, I'll do it again. All right, now there, let, let's...
you, you don't want the nose or you do want the nose? Tell me. Tell me now. You want the nose or the chin? Nose or the chin? Come on, tell me. Tell me now. I'll show you another ingrown if you're not careful. Here we go. There we go. Coming into focus now. There. Kind of. Let's see if I can find a juicy one here. Ew. 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 I'm not going to do the nose again. you guys got plenty of my nose. My email address is chris at perillo.com. Uh, I'm addicted to many things, whether they be hardware, software, webware, doesn't matter to me. I'm just a geek. And you can join the rest of us geeks here. We're typically talking tech 24 hours a day, 7 days a week at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.